Microsoft, please come from the heavens and give me a hug. Something, please. I can't. I can't anymore. So a very unique product has arrived on this channel, and it is the Microsoft Surface Duo. It's a foldable phone by Microsoft, and I'm very interested to see how I can use this day to day and see if this is something that I can see be used in the future by a lot of people. So let's get into the unboxing. And one thing I want to note is for my unboxing videos, they're not a review, it's just my first impressions. So without further ado, the pull tab is at the top. God, this, I already know this thing is going to be beautiful. Oh man. Microsoft product smells so good. So this does have the Snapdragon 855. It has 128 gigabytes of storage and six gigabytes of RAM. The suction is perfect. <laughs> I'm so giddy right now. Oh. Oh, it smells like mangoes. God, it smells so good. Wow, this is surprisingly light. All right, let's peel this off. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Wow. Wow, this is crazy. Can it sit like that? Oh my God, this is so cool. Oh, it's a soft closing too. It smells like mangoes. This is so lightweight. This, oh my God, this is, it's not even on yet. And it goes all the way around and it's soft. I'm honestly just in shock for the most part. Also, when I was watching the reveal, just the way the guy was speaking, it seemed like he put his heart and soul into keeping this a secret and revealing it to the world and man i can i can already feel the quality of this device it's just wow so on the sides of the device we have our sim card tray which is protected right now from the outer shell and then we also have a fingerprint reader the lock button as well as the volume up and volume down all in all i will say this is just beautiful so let's finally get this thing powered on this just wow i feel like i'm holding a book can this fit in my pocket let's see perfectly fine no problem no problem it's a bit chunky not gonna lie but it fits in the pocket powered by android look at the screen wow man wow Look how much real estate is in front of me right now. It's telling me that I need to update my phone and then on the other side, it's giving me my installation. I mean, in terms of practicality, I don't think that matters that much, but wow, this is so, it feels so good. I cannot wait till I get into the interface and just this design, look at this. Whoa, whoa, wait, whoa, how? Wait, so if I, Double tap to switch screens. So if I want to use this side, I just double tap. And it is getting a little bit hot right here. This is probably where the processor is. This side is pretty cool to the touch. I mean, seriously guys, how cool is this? You want more screen? Boom. You can't tell me that isn't cool. Wow, Microsoft, I am impressed. Every single Microsoft product that I've gotten on this channel, starting with the Surface Laptop 3, then the Book 3, and now the Surface Duo, I've been impressed time and time again. This by far, just in terms of setting this up, this might be one of my favorite devices on this channel, hands down. In terms of just innovation, and just the future of phones, 
potentially Microsoft, I'm glad he took a step in this direction. In terms of the LG Wing, uh, if you could send me that, that'd be nice so I can actually get first hands-on experience. But looking at pictures and videos, I don't know how I feel about the Wing. This is the coolest thing. And the fact that it can continue to go all the way around. So one thing I wanna mention is that I'm really happy that Microsoft is teaming up with Google to make a device like this. Like, I think Microsoft is just putting their ego inside and saying, hey, we can't make a good phone OS. We're just going to use the leverage of Android and combine it with our Microsoft services in order to make the best possible device that we can. And I think in terms of these billion dollar companies putting their differences aside to try and make the best product for the consumer in terms of hardware and software, I'm really happy to see that. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Ooh. Oh, what the background's black. Oh, it's the night sky. This is beautiful. Guys, look how fluid this is. The seamless transition. So we have our Microsoft suite down here. So what does this do? Google Assistant, hello, how are you? I'm celebrating Hispanic Heritage Month. Hey. I've been learning about the great contributions of this wonderful community, which means I've been learning a lot. Well, that was unexpected. But as you guys can see, so I have Google Assistant on one side and I can still do what I want to do on the other side of the screen. Oh, Microsoft, this, uh, I can't explain this. This might, I don't even know what to say. I'm just so impressed. The design elements of this thing. This GPU looks very different from anything else Nvidia has put out before. The 10 series, I thought, always looked like Ninja Turtles. I love the way those things looked, and I think most people did at the time. The 20 series was less appealing to me. It's more simpler design. But this year, the 30 series looks awesome. I love the design language on this thing. To me, it's like the fins, right? Normally, there's some kind of shroud that covers up a lot. Guys. <laughs> Microsoft, we need to talk. Please, just let me talk to one of your engineers about this one-on-one. -on -one. I'm just fascinated by the ingenuity of this. I can be in my meeting and watch a video and act like I'm paying attention, but being serious, in terms of productivity, I feel like I can be much more productive with this because this feels like a phone on one side and a phone on the other, but if that is, I guess, too overwhelming for you, you can just flip over and you're down to just one screen as if you had a regular one. And the best thing of it all the soft closing is so good. This is perfect. This, Microsoft, I love you. I have to say it, I love you. This is beautiful. So look, I'm watching my video on top and then I'm doing my important stuff on the bottom. Like, wow. <gasps> look at, another thing I've noticed guys, look, I can just throw this on the other screen if I want. Throw it back down. Look at the fluidity in that. Microsoft! All right, let's open up the camera app. We gotta take some selfies. Wow. Wow, this camera's looking nice. All right, let's take a photo real quick. Mmm, I'm looking good. Portrait mode too. Hit me up. Nice. We got video and honestly, this is passable. We're gonna have to go outside, but right now it's like 10 o'clock at night, so I can't go to my daily places of where I take videos, but honestly, this looks pretty good. Next, we got slow-mo. I don't know how slow this is gonna be, but. Now, can I use both screens? Oh, I can, I can, I can. Let me show you, let me show you. So to use both screens, here's what you do. You just put it in the center and both of them highlight, and there you go. That. <sighs> Microsoft, please come from the heavens and give me a hug, something, please. I can't, I can't anymore.
The animations, man. Even when I swipe up, look at the icons on the bottom. They all move to the other side. Swipe down, they move back. I'm done. I can't talk about this device anymore. It feels so good, by the way. My God, that's just... This is... <laughs> this is like my MacBook Pro 16. It's like, this video has to end. It... <sighs> We're done. 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 This is... <laughs> this is this is by far my favorite product on the channel by far nothing comes close to this until the iphone 12 until that comes out and i see what it's like no 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 this by far i don't care if the iphone 12 folds 12 times this Actually, if it folds 12 times, I might be impressed. iPhone 12 folds 12 times. No, this, by far, my favorite product on the channel so far. Might even be for the entire year, if I'm gonna be real with you. But my review will come out in the upcoming weeks on the Surface Duo. Make sure to stay subscribed if you wanna see more content on this. Let me know if you have any questions. I will try to keep you guys updated as much as I can, but Microsoft, you are now three for three on first impressions and unboxings. This is beautiful and I can't wait to explore more of it. As always guys, much love. Hello, CEO of Microsoft, please. Hey, listen, we need to talk, man. Let's put our differences aside. Um, I know I review a lot of Apple products, but to be on a serious note, what I have in my hand right now is a fantastic device. Although I am in the honeymoon phase, so after a couple days, I'm gonna have to see if I really like this device or not. But in all seriousness, this is this is a really nice phone. But uh, I gotta go, I gotta talk to you later. So, see ya. Honestly amazing, just opening this up. Oh, it's upside down, I feel dumb. <laughs>